what's up everybody? Uh, my name is Luca. I like to do judo because uh, I like making George sad. <laughs> <laughs> what is your plan for George today? Uh, today I would like to maybe knee him in the eye because I owe him a black eye, you know. Oh, he gave uh, you the black eye? Yes. Uh, Can you see the black eye? Yeah. My name is Luca and I'm here to do judo and uh, I work part-time as, uh, as an undertaker and a mortician. <laughs> hey, what's up guys? Uh, I go to the gym because girls like my abs, you know? So that's, that's what I live for. Chicks and judo and abs. <laughs> Alright, I'm here with Greg. Uh, who do you have, George versus Luca tonight? In the Vandori card. It's George all the way. I bet on Luca last time in the sumo and I lost. <laughs> and George laughed at me. I definitely got my money on George for this one because I heard uh, he doesn't sweat, he just glistens. You know? So. <laughs> Hit it! All right, here we go. George versus Luca. They're both right sided, right? Luca kind of comes out lefty with his lead leg left. They're both trying to put their left hand on first, right? Their right hand's generally a little bit more defensive. Right, he's looking for that sode, obviously, with that grip there. It's one of Luca's moves. He goes for the T, abandons the, the sode, and he goes for the Georgian grip, and then he goes immediately for some Migaesh. Right here, I'm telling him, hey, go Niwaza, but we're not really doing Niwaza this one. It's more of a Tachiwaza round, so that is that. Right? So, first exchange is done. Left hand on first, right? See how Luca's right hand is up. George's right hand is up. So that's good defensively and offensively, right? Luca has the slight advantage here. George goes for a Kataguma. That's a smart move, right? He gets out gripped. Uh, first hand on initiative by Luca, and then he goes for the Kataguma. That's sort of the right move there, right? Because he's already sort of behind, right? He went for it. He didn't get it. That's okay. He could transition to Niwaza, X, Y, and Z, right? Similar thing happening here, right? Luca has the advantage, right? Two exchanges in a row, he's taken the initiative. So he's sort of uh, a little bit ahead here, I think. But now George has two hands on, and Luca is standing to his left, which is not good. But he immediately abandons it for this Georgian. Right? Goes for that Uchimata and gets a nice score there. Right? Very nice, very nice move by Luca. That Sode Sode Georgian grip is very dangerous, right? Something that uh, Luke has been working on, something that I've been working on with him, and uh, something that I suggest because they play really well off each other, right? So when the person comes in, posts on that left hand, he could look to threaten that Sode and then immediately go into that Georgian, right? Always sort of a good look when you could do double threats, right? He has two systems that kind of combine together, which is is a really nice thing right he's standing lefty completely though that's not good because he can't attack from there right george should have unloaded there but his hips are a little bit far back luca again with the advantage here looking for kataguma right looking there we go george is looking for kataguma luca goes for that ipon senagi right and that's that danger with having that initiative with the left hand goes for that sleeve reaches in has to get rid of that sleeve. Luca just completely standing as a lefty now. Right? He has Ipon Senagi, Georgian grip. George goes for that Kataguma for the third time, right? You go for three bailout attacks of the same kind in a row. It's very easy to be exploited. So Luca does exactly that because he knew it was coming. Right? Initiative, tricep grip, goes for the Kataguma. Right? He looked to counter it. Luca is way ahead in this round. And he has that post. George is going around the side. And this is something that he's doing Luca defensively because he knows George. George likes that to side from there. So he's trying to prevent him, his shoulder from getting trapped. All right. George goes for that lefty Ponsenagi. There's that grip. Okay, now it's time to start unloading. Ochi, Osoto, snap downs, all those things are big. Looking for that Ashiwaza, right? Luca's a little bit trouble here, but let's see what he does. Right? Generally, if we were playing, you know, penalties and stuff, tournament rules, he would get a, a penalty here. Right? George can take it down, force Newaza generally. I guess we are going into Newaza now. Sit some. 
I need to get the hooks in, right, George? <laughs> yeah, George is looking good here. Luca <laughs> sort of in the clear already. Oh, yep, yeah, transitions. Nice, nice, very nice Nawaza sequence. All right, looking to work that wrist. Going down to the lever, long lever arm, right? Going down to the wrist, right? Gets that nice juji finish. Oh, beautiful, nice. beautiful. All right, 30 seconds, 30 seconds. Let's go, 30 seconds. Get one more score. All right, good round so far. Good round so far. Uh, George has an arm bar. Luca has uh, a couple scores. Maybe off that Katagruma counter. The mask comes off. Right, you know it's getting serious now. Same idea, double post. Right, looking for that sode, looking for that sode. Right, looking the sode, take the hand off. Now he's in good position. Overhand, right? George looked to return that right hand over, but Luca denied it. Right, that's always a, a good situation. And here we go. Now we are going into golden score. Right, golden score, winner takes all. I know Luca is winning the match, but you know, might as well do a golden score here. Right? Luca's fine. Left Sode, nice attack. Right? Drop Sode, too. Very good, very good. Right? Luca does that really well. High Sode, high Sode, drop Sode. Right? Luca's really uh, coming together with his uh, judo system. All right, puts that hand on, goes for that Georgian, goes for Sumi, almost, almost. Really, really nice. Georgian's tired here, right? I know this seems a little bit one-sided where Luca's kind of beating on George a little bit, but they go back and forth. You know, they're a very, very good partner for each other, and sometimes George wins and sometimes Luca wins, and it's a very, very good sort of dojo rivalry, right? That's always a, a thing. Goes for Tomonage, not quite. Right, these two guys look pretty tired. Yeah, I think George needed to really force some of the action, you know, throughout the match and really, you know, he outgripped Luca maybe once and he didn't capitalize on it. Right? So he's got to work a little bit about on uh, countering some of the stuff that Luca does in terms of gripping wise and you know, the three katagrumas in a row from bad position, right? That's something that Right, oh, there's that Patagruma by Luca for the win. All right, if you have any ideas, comments, please leave it down below. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Oh, nice work, guys. Nice work. Nice work. Nice. Fucking hate this. Fucking hate this score. Fucking hate this. Dude, it's not a good time. <laughs>